Yo, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to another video. A lost in the Chargers franchise. We are in the wild card. Last week we did. I was gonna say clinch, but we kind of already clinched. But we solidified ourselves as a number two seed. I remember the beginning of the season when we were like, I don't even know what we were like one in three or something like that. We got to check. Our I did this last week, but well, I just did this a couple minutes ago. Not minutes ago, but. Like an hour ago, actually, because <laughs> I just recorded that last episode, like an hour ago. Um, what was I looking at? Teams got the rest of what I was looking at. Regular season, right? We started the season one and three in the first five weeks, right? And we made all those trades at the bye week, which was at the fifth week. And we just started winning a couple games and we lost and we got right back on track and never lost another game. After those two losses, again, we never lost another game. So it's kind of it's kind of nice to see all these games how they turned out, and none of these games were really blowouts. That Chief game was kind of a blowout because Patrick Mahomes could not hold on to the ball. That Broncos game was kind of hard because of Melvin Ingram, and yeah, that's it. I don't. Get, I guess the Broncos game again once we blew them out the other way, but no game was really a blowout though. That Steelers game was kind of a blowout because both of us sucked on offense, but. Majority of the games, I don't think I need slider changes. I was thinking about it last episode, so like maybe I need slider changes, but I really don't. We're not playing fantastic. Uh, we are going to go over uh, regular season stats and awards just really quickly because we're not going to actually, even if we do win MVP, player of the year, whatever, it's not going to count until the con like after, well, Super Bowl week, basically. So Justin Herbert had a really, really good season. I believe he led the, um, led the league. Well, yeah, led the league in the yards. Almost 5,000 yards in a um, in this season. Why am I blanking on my words? 5,000 yards this season, 34 t touchdowns, and 25 picks. Now, let's compare these stats to his stats last season. And he's obviously better in yards. He wanted more touchdowns, but the interceptions was really, really bad. Really bad. He got sacked 17 times this year. Completions went up. Attempts went way up. And the completes percentage went down. Yards per game, I mean, yards per average, yards per attempt, <laughs> yards per average, <laughs> yards per attempt went down, and yards per game went up. So I would say this season was a good one. If you would have lowered the interceptions by at least 10, I would have been like, yeah, this was a good one. He almost had, he, if he would have had 40 touchdowns, then I would have been like, yeah. He just struggled a little bit during that, like, midweeks. Uh, Kareem Hunt. He missed about how many games did he play in? He only played in nine games. So he missed like what? What is that? Seven? Not not really a math guy, as you can tell. He missed about seven games. And yeah, he he got over five hundred yards. So you could tell he was gonna eclipse that um a thousand yards per game like threshold. A thousand yards per game. That's crazy. A thousand yard season. He he definitely would have. Got that if he played in a few more games. Joe Reed getting almost 1,500 and six touchdowns. Dorian Dell eclipsed 1,000 yards and 11 touchdowns. Hunter Henry almost getting 1,000 yards and only missing three games. So if he would have played in those three games, he definitely would have got 1,000. Marquise Goodwin coming in around the midseason mark, I want to say. Yeah, I want to say around that week five, week six-ish. And he got over 500 yards. And both our running backs was heavily in the running game, too. We'll check out uh, Drew Tranko, who led the league and not like led our team in tackles by a lot. Led the league. Led the team. Keep saying fucking league. Led the team in uh, tackles for loss by a lot, also. Uh, Kenneth Murray with eight. Chandler Wilson with eight. Trey Hendrickson with eight. And sacks, I believe Joey Bosa led that with 11.5, six and a half for Jerry Tillery, six for Chandler Wilson, five for Kenneth Murray. And interceptions, that might be Durham James, nope, that's Sir Adley. Durham James had six, and Sir Adley had eight. So, why is it not counting him for it at all? It's not counting Sir Adley. That's so weird. 
That's really strange. Led, well, we was fourth in offense and first in defense. Interesting. So let's check out these awards. I don't think we're going to have MVP. Aaron Rodgers won MVP. And uh, nope, we don't. We don't. We don't. Coach of the year. We were fifth. Fifth. Offensive player of the year. Do we have one? Nope. That's very interesting. Defensive player of the year. No. Drew Tranquil was at five. That's interesting. Offense rookie of the year, Dorian Dell. That's huge. Hopefully he goes up in development. Hopefully, like, just give him superstar. He deserves it. Defensive rookie. Of the year. I don't think we had a defensive rookie on our team. Best QB, Justin Herbert at four. Best running back. Don't think we'll have one in here. Best wide receiver, Flip Dorsett and Dorian Dell and Joe Reed were at three and four. Offensive line, we're definitely not. Actually, we do have one in here. Uh, Brian Bulaga was in here. Interesting. Defensive lineman. Did we have one? No, we didn't. Linebacker, uh, Drew Tranquil. Interesting. That's an interesting award for him. Mr. Adley won defensive back of the year. Uh, Derwin James at number two. Interesting. And kicker, our kicker. Can kickers get devops? Not devops, but can they go up and dev? I've never seen it. What are their strengths? Tell me how to beat them. So Jayon Brown is out. That's interesting. Um, I need your release to be up, so whatever brings your release up, I'll take that. It's going to be deep route. Boots you up to 81, but you are playing upper morale, though. Plus, lead to crat catching. I'll say cratching. I don't know what that fuck that means. And one to release. So, your release is at what, 78 now, and your catching is in the 90s. And you have 95 catching. If we get that release in the 80s, mid 80s at least, yeah, you'll be different. Uh, Nasir Adderley, we're going to just go zone because that's what you need the most, and that's what you play the most. You're uh, obviously a free safety. So it says he's, he's a pro bowler. Interesting. That's very interesting. Uh, do we want to do Justin Jones? No, we'll probably just do Brian Bulaga and get out of here. Go whatever is the most. That's going to be patch, patch. That gives you a plus, plus two to overall and a lot of ones. Well, three ones. You're 32. How long are you under contract for? Well, you shouldn't regress that hard. You are 32, though, so you really might regret. They're 84. Oh, man. This is going to be a tough game. We do have home field advantage so far. And the only game we won't have home field advantage for is the game against the Bengals. These uniforms kind of go hard. I ain't going to lie. And we had to come out in the classics, the uh, Houston Oilers jerseys. The problem that I do have about the Madden CPU, their quarterbacks rarely miss any throws. No matter what you have their QB accuracy on. I remember I had it on like 20 before, and he still was missing the same amount of throws they are now. Which is none. The most they might miss in the game is five. And in order to miss five, you at least need two interceptions. Which is like, come on, bro. I thought the Chiefs were playing the Texans. I don't know. Okay. Let's come out here and have a good game. There we go. There we go. Picking up the first now. Let's get some blocks to this left side. Hopefully they pick it up. They did, but I just couldn't I couldn't find a hole. Fourth and one from midfield. Do we go for it? I think we don't. Yeah, I don't think we do. What are you? I just want to know what are you doing right there? You're not even making a play for the ball. He 
He just stiffed on like two people. There we go. Nasir Adley coming away with the sack on that one. That's a huge one, too. Oh, good drop. Oh, he threw that quick to him, too. That's fourth? What the hell? I didn't even know that was third down. I thought it was second. Catch it. Big hit. Ooh. Good thing you have excellent fucking hands, bro. There we go. Um, Joe Reed on the catch. We're 4 4, 56 yards. Let's try to, like, get this run game going. It's very hard right now. I'm going to run to this left side of the field. They're blitzing on the right. Good run. Yeah, I didn't want it to be that exaggerated. I just wanted like a halfback dive up the middle. There's no way. Holy shit. He wasn't even in front of the ball. Like, can we get a replay on that? Uh, okay. Okay. I'll give him that. I'm say, don't make, don't let him win. Like, I know Hunt, De Derrick Henry, I'll say Hunter Henry. Derrick Henry is, like, really good, but, like, come on. You can't let him win those. What did you do? Like, he played that. I know I went for the intel. I probably shouldn't have been going for intel in that situation. But, golly, man. Fuck. Oh, my God. What an intel! Let's go. Michael Davis, I believe. Beautiful coverage. Beautiful coverage. Gonna run a screen to this left side of the field. They're blitzing now. Something could potentially be open. Probably shouldn't have ran the blitz when I saw him come down on that. I thought it could have been special for us. What a gra- oh my god. Hunter Henry is on another level with these catches in these past few weeks. I feel like every week he's just coming away with another grab that's ridiculous. There we go. Oh, how did you overthrow that? You been kind of accurate these past few weeks, bro. I left him. The over the middle will be open. Okay, third and 21. See if we can actually get something. He's open downfield like crazy open. Thank you, Joey. Someone had to get in there with me. had all day. There we go. Do 
Yeah, we got this. Oh, I probably should have went fucking aggressive. I thought he had a step on him. That's why I went. Uh, I went for the rack. Yeah, they go to Derrick Henry a little bit more. Had to throw it away. Joey Bosa was making his way in there. Joey Bosa is very disruptive. Especially right now. They're not going to get the first. They go short. Ryan Tannehill. 6 of 10 for 25. I think it says 25. I might say 60. It should say 60. I don't know why I read said 25. But I felt like I saw 25. Okay. Pressure just got in, man. What do you do? What do you do? There we go. First down. It's like that's the f oh, the first first down in a long time. My control just disconnected in the middle of a throw. And it, it was on the charger. How did it disconnect on the charger? This game. Well, not this game. This fucking stupid controller. I was passing it to um, Kareem Hunt. Going towards it. Um, was that an inbounds catch? Not at all. Oh! There we go! Let's fucking go defense. Why would he throw that? Just throw it away at that point. Tip pick to the house. And it was hit by Jenkins, I believe. Nice one, nice one. Let's go. You get some points finally. So our first points of the game are on a defensive touchdown. Uh, we don't get ball at half, but... We have a chance to put some more points on the board, though. You have to be kidding me. You have to be kidding me. He doesn't even trip over me. Okay, they get points immediately right back. You know, the problem with this, uh, well, the issue I'm having with this, um, their, their defense is that they're, like, they're, the pressure that they get in and the run stopping that they do is so hard to counter it's like yeah we could try to pass the ball but the pressure gets in so fast that you need quick immediate routes and sometimes we need we need time for the routes to develop and we just don't have the time that's the biggest thing we just don't have the time sometimes it's me that's me man i i went for the rat catch for no reason Okay, there we go. We get some yards. Big yards. Let's go. We're at midfield now. We have three timeouts, and now's the time we will start using them. There we go. Justin Jackson, get out of bounds. That's how you gain some yards. Make them work for it. Well, they're making us work for it. I don't know why I said that. That's just like a fucking catchphrase. Or not. It's not really a fucking catchphrase, but... Just something I say. Call timeout. So we, we could potentially have a few chances to get in this end zone. Especially depending what plays we call. And uh, it's going to be a first down. Going to call another timeout. Let's run the end around. Let 
Not even close. We're going to take our three. That was a horrible play call. So it's going to be an easy fail goal. It's going to put us up 10 to 7, heading into halftime. This is a very strange game so far. A lot of mistakes happening on both sides of the ball. I don't like it. Someone just told me, I hope you're staying safe during the snowstorm today. And how did they know we was getting a snowstorm today? We don't live in the same area. Or oh, same city. Let me not say same area. We don't live in the same city. That's me. That, that That's not really me because I'm not supposed to be guarding that deep. And there was two underneath the open. So I think I made the right decision. I'm not going to lie. For us. Let's like right now. That was a nasty run. Not nasty in a good way. Almost over pursuit. There we go, Joey Bosa. Well, Drew Tranquil actually got a nice tackle. It is third and five. I would suspect they pass here. Come on, tackle. Okay, they're short. They're going to go for three. I wouldn't be opposed to going for those. Them. I do have Derrick Henry. They tie this game up at 10. Oh, man. Uh, defense kind of slacked on that one. That was a good move. I feel like I was about to catch both of them with that move, actually. Uh, do we want to run this? I do. I'm going to run it. Come on. Just, just give me a first. There we go. Four forward. 12 rushes for 37 yards. Not a ideal game. Not like last week's game, but we're trying, man. We're trying. There we go. Marquise Goodwin. Now we are in field goal range. Just getting over 200 yards on the day now. His release is just so bad, man. I know I was trying to air it out, but fuck. Fourth and 13. Can we get a field goal from here? 52-yarder. Should be fairly easy, right? Golly, we just fucked this field goal, didn't we? Fuck! Like, um, I can't cover both those routes. Yeah, I believe we stopped him. Inches. They're going one running back, three tight ends. All out blitz. Let's go. We end up stopping him, but fucking hell, man. Just nobody getting in on that is so frustrating. There we go. Tackle for loss. Let's go. Mm-hmm. Nobody open. Let's go. Hold him to three. A lot of time left, fellas. Gonna need points on this drive. Very important drive for us on uh, offense. Huh. 
Hunter could have turned around and tried to get that. They're blitzing. Let's just try to not be dumb about this, fellas. Please, please, please let me get yards. Let me get yards. Fuck. Oh my gosh. I need 15 yards on this. There we go. Keep running, keep running, get out. There we go. As long as we get yards, I'm cool. He fumbled, he fumbled, he fumbled. Joe Reed fumbled. That shit hurt it. What a drive we were having, though, man. Oh my gosh, they just ran the fucking monster, or monster, what the fuck it's called, man. Good shit, fellas. Oh, he, he... Let me hit him, Jovi! Okay, we cannot give up fucking, what, 16 yards. Don't even give up 10. We're going Tampa. I kind of don't want to run Tampa, but... Okay, we gave up 10. There's going to be a field goal, hopefully. Please don't go for it. All right. Okay. We're going to basically have a two-minute warning to get downfield and score a touchdown. And we get a field goal. Okay, they just missed. Just like we missed earlier. Oh, my God. Why do we have so many close games with the Titans? There we go. He's going to go to a two-minute warning now. There we go. Getting yards pretty quickly. No reason to call timeouts. No reason to go no huddle. Let's just make it happen. Yeah, I thought it was double. That would have been a risky, that would have been a devastating into I would have threw an into right there. Good way to stay in bounds. Do we take the three right here? I think we go for it. I think we go for it. I think we go for it. Did I say I think we go for it enough? Mm-hmm. Good decision. Okay. We have time on our side. Hunter tried to freak it. Oh, my God. Justin. He fucking slides? Are you kidding me? It's third down. We got to try to punch this in. Do we pass this? Trust it, trust it, trust it. Trust it! Fucking go. I'm going to go for two. What a catch by Dorian. What a ball placed in my Justin. Now they're going to have to drive all the way downfield. They have three timeouts, though, so it's possible they could do this. 
Oh my God! What a what a game! What a game! Game's not over yet, though. He's going deep. I'm going to say Adley with a pick. No, they're just going to say out of bounds. They got a bounce, but game is over. What a fucking game. This is incredible. Oh, my God. Ooh, this game was very... It's always against the Titans we have a crazy game against. Doesn't hurt to do for 314. No touchdowns in one end, so... Ryan Tannehill threw for 248, no, or well, one touchdown, no, two intos. Um, his throwing was weird today. Cream Hunt had a kind of a bad game on the ground, 2.9. Averaging, mm -mm. Joe Reed and Hunter Henry had, well, no, that's not even Hunter Henry, it's Derrick Henry. <laughs> Joe Reed had a really impressive game. It's crazy game. No touchdowns, but it was a good game. It definitely was. Definitely was. Uh, we just spread the ball out, I think, at a good rate. He didn't get 10 catches. Next highest was 5. The next highest was 3. Then, yeah. Very entertaining game. A little stressful, but entertaining nonetheless. So we advance to the divisional round of the playoffs. Let's see who we'll be facing. We have the Texans. So, oh, so Chiefs, Chiefs won. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I, I didn't understand how it worked at first, but now I kind of do. See, so you have the Texans. I kind of want to see who's on that Texans team. <laughs> Yeah, I guess that's all we have to get up to. Get, get into. I said get up to. That's all we have to get into for this episode. Very good game. Joey Bosa had a really, really good game. Joey Bosa is really, like, becoming that dude for us. I like it. Um, What else? I think that's all we have to get into. If you did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next video. But until next video, peace. These niggas unusual, ayy, these bitches will screw you all I already blew, it's over, say I put that bitch to control you, I made a fist with the code,